Hi everyone, Matt Watson here from CarWow. So I've got an awesome drag race for you today. Got a bunch of performance cars, Audi R8 V10 Performance, got a Porsche 911 Carrera 4S, got a BMW M8 Competition, an AMG GTS four-door, and a seven-seater eco-friendly family SUV. And I've got a guest in it. That is really nice. Thanks, man. Someone who you wouldn't expect to find in such a car. Is that a factory colour? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's Yanni from Yanni Mize. Hi, mate. How you doing? Have we started yet? <laughs> yes, Yanni, we have started. <laughs> I am kind of wondering what the heck you are doing in a big family SUV, MPV, eco vehicle. Tesla gang. Have you ever driven a Model X before? No. It's got some impressive stats, hasn't it? Yes, yeah, 795 horsepower, 1140 newton meters. It's heavy, two and a half ton. Talking about weight. You've been losing a bit of weight, haven't you, recently? It's about a stone and a half, mate. Still got another stone to go, but yeah, I feel good. So I'm a bit annoyed that you are losing weight because your reaction times are always better than mine. But I can always put it back because of the fact I'm lighter, so. Do you fancy KFC? On my cheat day, not today, though. Damn it. Fat shamers, bring it, bring it. I'm ready for you guys, man. Anyway, let's move on to our other guest. It's Raz from Remove Before Race. And he's brought along his own AMG. So Raz, tell us about your car, mate. It's got AMG's four litre V8 in its most powerful form ever. So we've got 640 brake and 900 Newton meters going to all four wheels with Merck's Formatic Plus. So really serious beast here today. You're bragging about your numbers, but you're still way off. Yanni and his blooming family-friendly SUV thing. Nobody really cares about Yanni's car. We've got exhausts at least, you know? So it's going to be even more embarrassing when I leave you both on the start line. Yeah, so it could be a bit embarrassing. So this car, 5.2 litre, naturally aspirated V10. 620 horsepower. It's got 580 newton meters of torque, seven speed, dual clutch, automatic gearbox, launch control, quattro four wheel drive, mid motored engine, should have good traction off the line. And we've got the M8. So that has a 4.4 litre twin turbo V8. It's got 625 horsepower. It's a little bit less than the AMG GT four door. 750 newton meters of torque, so it's down on torque as well. But I know that thing launches really well. Four wheel drive yet again, eight speed auto. It's an impressive car, but it's heavy, 1,960 kilos. Heavier than this, because this is 1,600 kilos, as is the other yellow car here today, Porsche 911 Carrera 4S. Now, it may seem down on power with its three litre flat six twin turbo, 450 horsepower, and 530 newton meters of torque, but boy, does it launch. Brilliant eight speed automatic dual clutch gearbox. It's gonna be very interesting to see how this plays out. Anyway, make sure you subscribe to this channel, hit the bell icon to turn your notifications on so you're alerted when we make a new upload. Also, check out Yanni's channel, Yanni Mize, links below in the description. Also, check out Raz's channel. You can see stuff on AMGs and lots of other performance cars there. Also, follow me on Instagram, at Matt Watson Cars. Enough of that, let's get on with the race. But before we do, click on the pop-out banner up there in the top right-hand corner of the screen to vote which car you think is gonna win. You done that? Let's do it then, let's find out. Okay guys, let's race. Bogged. Oh! Everyone's gone. Come on, me and the BMW. My car f died and so did Raz's. Yeah, I'm gonna keep mine in Sport Plus. Wow, this is quick. Plus, I think it doesn't like race mode. Go warm up the tyres. I have got a home to go to, just putting it out there. Three, two, one. 
place and start off with that Tesla soaking off the line. Come on! Come on, all right! Bloody formatic system failing again. Ah, oh, he's quick. Freak. Unfortunately, the GT4 Four doors formatic system died yet again. Do you want me to drive it, Res, mate? Do you want me to show you how to drive it? This is getting from bad to worse. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, Yanni. We'll give him one more chance. He's bought his own car. It seems to be playing up. One more chance. If it doesn't work that time, you can't keep running races, can you? It just is what it is. Exactly. Final chance, please. One last chance to get myself together. <laughs> I've I, I got a film, I've got a film, I've got a film. Three! I've got a film, bye bye. Two! One! Oh, I'm bogged down a bit and he's gone! See, my reaction time's better than yours, Matt, but your car's quicker. And the Porsche doing well, and the M8! Got him now. Oh, this is quick, man. Look. The M8's doing well as well. This R8 wins the day, though. Oh, my God, the Merc finally turned up. Oh, hello. Hello. Turned up, did he? Well, you turned up, mate. Thanks for coming. I know, right? Amazing. Did you actually get a good run? I actually got a half decent one. It was a bit shaky at the start, but yeah, pretty good. That BMW is no joke. The fanboys must love that car. But what about the Porsche? I wasn't even watching. What Porsche? <laughs> so then, what exactly happened? Well, the Audi did the standing quarter mile in 10.7 seconds. The BMW took 11 seconds, the Tesla 11.1 seconds, the AMG 11.2 seconds, and the Porsche took 11.4 seconds. Now we're going to have a rolling race, 50 miles an hour, all the cars are in comfort mode, just cruising along, going to count it in. Right, guys, you ready? Get level. So here we go. Three, two, one, go! Kick down. Oh, now Raz is on it. Oh, the Merc. Oh, uh, look, after all the chat, finally. Can this R8 catch him? Oh, I'm getting killed now. Here we go. Can I catch him? Can I catch him? Woohoo, I actually won something. See ya. Raz, mate, don't back off unless you're frightened. At least give me the chance to get past you. So I can win a race. <laughs> I was too busy celebrating. I know your game. So this time... Let's do it locked in third gear. From 50 miles an hour. Right, now we're going to have a rolling race. Cars in sports setting, locked in third. Let's do it. OK, you ready, guys? Here we go. Three, two, one, go! This picked up so well. That Tesla's gone, though. So did that AMG. Let's see when they come past me. BMW at 100. Merc at 105. Here we go. Come in past the Annie now. 115. That M8 did the business. <laughs> Tesla's out of it. That BMW did the job. Did the Porsche ever get past you? What Porsche? <laughs> now, a lot of you might be saying I should have had the Porsche Panamera Turbo E Hybrid, kind of, but I've done quite a lot of times on that and the Panamera, and they're about the same. And I just wanted a sports car, really. So maybe Porsche should lend me one of the GT cars to race. Finally, then, we're going to have a brake test from 70 miles an hour. When we hit the line, full emergency stop, see what happens. I can't see the line. Can you see the change in surface? There it is. Get ready. <laughs> Come on, what's going to happen? Oh. 
Porsche. Did he cock that up? No, it felt fine at my end. No problem. <laughs> Brilliant break. Felt fine. Didn't look good though. He definitely cocked it up. As last time we did a brake test between an R8 and this very 911, it beat the Audi. No. I can't see how Raz did. Did he beat me? He beat all of us, mate. Do you reckon he cheated? I did not cheat. Do you know what, Raz? I'm going to give you that one. I can't tell from where I was sat. Yanni has beaten me for sure. I'm surprised by that Tesla. So then, what was the overall result? Well, in the end, the Audi won the drag race. The BMW won the rolling race. Though you could argue the Tesla actually did if we're talking about how fast you can actually drive legally on the road. And the AMG won the brake test. So something for everyone. Well, apart from Porsche fans. Listen, thank you very much for watching this video. Make sure you follow Yanni as well as our channel. And of course, check out Raz over at Remove Before Race. We're all good. Don't worry, Yanni, you can go home now. He's been moaning to go home for bloody ages. Can I go home? Yeah, I've got a, I've got a family to go to.